what is the most courageous thing you've ever done? The most courageous thing I've ever done is something I try to do every day. It's choosing connection over comfort when it comes to my relationship with my husband. Uh, it's like choosing to have someone that you share your inner thoughts and inner feelings to have a connection with them is really scary to me and like offering it to him, not just waiting for him to ask me. And that's really scary, but I try to do it. Most courageous thing I've ever done would be quitting my job when Jesus told me to without knowing where I will end up in three months. Will I have a job in three months? Will I have enough money? All the, all the things that came up in me, leaving my comfort zone. Um, that was the most courageous thing I've ever done, I guess. And it was totally worth it. I experienced how faithful Jesus is and knew and um, I would do it over and over again. That was totally worth it. Hi, my name is Johnny Daniel. I am from Redding, California. And the most courageous thing I have ever done is to go to therapy. It took me a while to get to that point of actually admitting that I needed it. And I came to this place of realizing that I owe it to myself and to my family that I wanted to become a better person and actually deal with some issues that I've been putting off. So long story short, I partnered with the Holy Spirit and found an amazing therapist or counselor and actually diving deep into my past and some of the crap I've been through and walking that with them and the Holy Spirit has been just a transformative journey and so fruitful and to where it's obvious, you know, even for me to see it. So it's been a long, long journey, but it's definitely been worth it to see the results and to get to keep going after my fears and becoming whole. Hi everyone, my name is Sabrina and something courageous that I did was when I was a kid actually. I was 12 years old and at my house and I hear some screaming outside of my house. And so I go there and outside and I see that my dog, which was a toy schnauzer, was being attacked by two German Shepherds. So I run straight to where she is and as a 12 year old, I try to take both German Shepherds from the back of their necks and try to separate them from where my dog is. And of course that didn't work. Um, so I tried, you know, screaming, kicking, sip, like tried to separate, tried anything to separate them. And finally my dog is able to maneuver and get under a car and the two German Shepherds leave. And when I look around, there's like more people that could help her and everything, anything like that, but they didn't. So I think that it was the love, the passion that I had to take care of my dog, that I didn't want anything bad to happen to her, that is kind of like motivated me to take action. And it was a really quick decision. Would I do it again? I'll probably consider it more um, since, you know, your life can be in danger with doing this, but um, that, that's something that I did as a kid. Hi, my name is Gabriela, and I believe that the most courageous thing I've ever done is to forgive myself when I do something wrong, even though I believe that I don't deserve it or other people don't, but to cling to his righteousness instead of our own and just to offend our minds and believing truly what he says is true. Hey guys, it's your girl Laura from Daily Dose of Courage and if you enjoyed this video, I have an opportunity for you. I would love to make more videos like this, so if you also have a story that speaks about courage, whether that's something you did once in your life or that's something you do on a daily basis, then feel free to shoot me a message on social medias. I have linked everything down below and I would love to hear your story and see how I can incorporate that into my next video. But that's it for today. I hope you guys are having a great New Year's Eve and I'll see you all next year. Bye!